Hey Lestrangians, it's Ashlita, and I have a video using LA Girl round brushes, the dupe for the Artiste brushes that are super expensive. Um, that's how I got my makeup look today. Um, and this is the end result, so I hope y'all like this. I hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. I love you guys. What's up, Lestrange? It's Ashlita, and I'm back with a get ready and a kiki. Um, first things first, while I'm getting ready for work, is I had a package, unexpected package. I had no idea where it was coming from. One moment. I knew I had not ordered anything, so I was very surprised. So, I didn't even see who it was from. I just ripped it open, and I'm like... I didn't order this, and it's Elf's Illuminating Eye Cream with Purified Water, Cucumber, and Green Tea. I considered buying this, but I didn't. So, then I found this little card from Elf, and it says, we are so sorry. Your order didn't get to you in time, and that's our fault. We understand how frustrating the experience was and want to make it better. We appreciate our customers, and we're working towards improving our online shopping experience. Please accept this gift as our apology. Apology accepted, Elf. I'm excited to try this soon. <clears throat> like tomorrow. Um, but I decided, um, I did a haul of these from IK House. I have more, but I'm probably not going to do eyeshadow or eyeliner today. So I decided to try these brushes out <clears throat> um, as I get ready. And have a little kiki with my friends. So first things first. Oh, here, huh? I have my beauty blender. Just in case. Um, I like to see the beauty gurus using like those big ass artiste brushes. So we're going to slather that first. Did you get soaking of the product? I'm not really sure. I forgot what brand this is. I'll have to go and do my research. The handle moves too much so I prefer to just hold it like so. Yeah, it's um fuck my eyebrow. Use a more I'm gonna have to layer up and fix my eyebrow. See, it doesn't get to the eyebrow. Around the eyebrows that easily. It feels like it gets around the nose pretty well. But I have a, you see the space there? So let me fix my eyebrow and I'll be back. Actually, I'm not. <clears throat> We're gonna add a little bit more and then I'll come back and do my eyebrow. Normally it doesn't take this much to cover this mug. I don't really use brushes on my face to do foundation. Before I start using a beauty blender, um, not the beauty blender, Real Techniques um, sponge, I used to use my hands. Cause I was like, sponge, what? I'm 
gonna have to use my sponge to hit this forehead. Oh, I run these edges. I didn't blend it. Alright. <clears throat> so now, um, I don't know what kind of concealer I'm going to use. I think I'm going to use the little brush. Right, let's try some. All right, I know what I'm going to do. Using the shape tape, <clears throat> I'm not going to use this brush. I'm going to use, yeah, I will. Do I? Do I? I need to hurry and make a decision. You know what? I'm not using... Let's see. All right, I'll use this one. I think I've, well, this is spreading a long way. It's definitely more dense. Oh, I could do that with my eyebrow. Okay. Okay, okay. I don't need as much product. Okay, we're gonna have a kiki. <clears throat> so my meerkat, my son, Mr. E, I had to take him to the doctor today. He has scrap throat. Oh, he's sick. But school's not in session today anyway. <clears throat> well, I feel like I have a hair. I don't know about this under eye. See how streaky we're getting? Oh, Jesus, yeah. Beauty blender. All the way. Or the way. And with shape tape, you really don't want to a layer, but I'm going to have to because it can end up patchy because it kind of dries down real quick. But I'm going to have to hit it uh, in here a little more. <clears throat> So America has scrub. And then yesterday I was going to pick up some Chinese food. And I was in my T-Mobile uniform. And where I parked was right in front of Metro PCS. And apparently I was in my mind daydreaming, strut my shit. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. And when I came up on the sidewalk, I, I don't know what happened. I don't know if I just didn't pick up my foot. I honestly have no clue. So I ended up um, getting my front of my shoe of my right foot, of the toe, snagged on the sidewalk and it tipped me forward and at first I didn't think I was gonna fall but shit I fell straight forward um I kept my head up so all that was fine I didn't hit my face but I scratched up the palms of my hands fucked up my right knee it hurts really bad it's swollen and it's red and my left knee's got some scratches but it's okay yeah let me fix my eyebrow 
my eyebrow. Um, so yeah. If somebody was recording, that shit would have went viral on social media. I guarantee you that. It was a hot mess. Some little girl coming from the Piggly Wiggly was like, are you okay? And honey, I popped up real quick. And I'm like, yeah, I'm fine. Like, nothing happened. It was more embarrassing than it actually hurt. Y'all know what I'm saying. I've been taking off this little part and like <clears throat> using it to fill in my brows because it makes it harder to do my to hold on to it and do my eyes. All right, since I use this brush for foundation, I'm gonna use this one to smear around my trans. Oh, you know what I should use? My Tarte Light Neutral Amazonian Clay Powder. I haven't used it in forever in this brush. So. And it looks dark. I hope that's enough powder. So I just, oh, here we go, getting too close to the brows. I don't know how I feel about this. Pat, 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 pat with this little brush. I wonder if I'm smearing my product in. I guess that looks all right. powder in my eyebrows and my hair. <clears throat> I have been putting them over here. Done. All right, let's see if we can contour. Get open. Thank you. I've got so much makeup that my drawers are broken. All right, so... I'm going to use my Fiona Styles in this. So we're going to start with the lighter. I need to hurry. I got to bust the move. mirrors in there with the cat. This is a powder contour. Just in case some of y'all don't know what I'm doing. How was y'all's Valentine's Day? I worked and I closed the store. And so I had to open the next day and I had a Valentine's Day to get but I had to cancel. The car just, I really was tired anyway. So I think that was just the universe speaking. <clears throat> but, um, the car started acting funky. She didn't want to go over 10 miles per hour. Yeah. 
you know what, I could go to work like this, so if it doesn't come out looking blended, <laughs> it's these brushes' fault. Oh no, once I get to work and look in those mirrors at work. So, I'm going to use the same brush, and we're going to do a little blush. See the blush. And I can't a little bit. And <clears throat> then I'm going to use my Wet n Wild highlighter and this last little brush here. can't see how this looks because my mirror is too far away. Actually, not so shabby. I might like this brush here better than the rest. Oh, la la. Look. Blend that in a little bit. Boom, boom. So yeah, so I didn't do shit for Valentine's. Didn't get no. So. But that's okay. I'm eventually gonna get it. Oh, and then there is a brush in here I want to use for my inner corner highlight. Let me pop that sucker out. It looks like it should be like a toothbrush. Unstable bristle in there. Oh, you're gonna really. You get up in there with a lot of product. even see that. I don't want to set that up too soon. Let me hit this with the pinkies. Yeah, the pinkies do better. As usual. I'm gonna finish my look, the um, like finish my brows, set my brows, um, my lips, fix my hair, and I'll be back. Okay. <laughs> 